What is up, gamers? The Red Dragon here, and got a special video for my buddy, Large Farva. His link will be in the description box. Be sure to check it out and tell him thanks for this Battlefield 4 tip. What's going on, guys? Farva here, and I want to share with you all a pretty effective method for using the JDAM bomb on the attack jets. Now, I've seen a lot of posts online and videos of people saying that the JDAM is kind of gimmicky, and it's very underpowered and pretty much useless. And I want to share with you guys a tip that hopefully will change that if that's the opinion that you have. I found the JDAM to be pretty powerful when used correctly, and I'm going to share that with you. Now, it should be noted that this works best on stationary armor. You're not going to want to try to hit something that's moving, but a lot of times on the battlefield, you'll find that one tank that's just kind of sitting there, and he's easy picking. So the first things first, when you spawn in in your jet, the one thing you need to do is you need to ascend. You need to get some air, and that's what I'm doing right here. You can see me, I'm starting to ascend. Now as I ascend, I switch over to the JDAM bomb, you'll see the little screen there, and I slow down by hitting S on the keyboard. After launching both bombs at the target, you're going to want to do a little gun run and then fly away. Now here I've bailed out just to show you guys that that jeep is no longer there, and then what I have just done was very effective. Now you might say this was just a jeep, I want to see some armor, but we're going to go into some actual in-game footage and I'll show you just how effective it is on tanks. There you have it guys, four simple little tips to using the JDAM effectively. I really hope this video helped you out and if you decide to try this let me know in the comments section how it worked out for you. If you liked the video drop a like and a comment, I try to reply to every single one of them and hopefully this goes without saying but at the end of your gun strafe make sure you have enough time to pull up so you don't end up like this. Thank you for watching.